Hey everyone, today I've got a Reformation haul for you. Of course, I'll be trying everything on and I cannot wait because Reformation is one of my favorite places to shop and there are so many gorgeous pieces in at the moment and it's quite a big haul. I need to decide what I'm gonna keep and what I'm gonna return. So I would appreciate your feedback in the comments because it genuinely helps me so much. So I'm gonna start with the tops. I also got some dresses and some skirts. Actually, I'm really excited about the skirts, but this is the first thing I picked up. Now, in person, I don't love it as much as I thought I would. On the website, I was a bit more excited about it. They did have other prints, but yeah, not really a fan of like the copper metallic and then on the yellow. I'll show you what it looks like on anyway because they do have other colors, but yeah, this is the first piece. Okay, I definitely like it more on. I love the style, but I just don't think I will pick it out enough and wear it enough. Also, it's quite big. I mean, I don't have much of a chest, but it's quite, do you know what I mean? I thought it was gonna be like super tight. So yeah, this just isn't quite right for me. But like I said, they do have different patterns and colors and yeah, it's just not quite my bag and that's okay. This next one is something that I've been waiting to come back in stock. How sweet is this? Now I have ordered something very similar from a UK designer. So I'm going to see when that arrives, how similar they are, because obviously I'd rather support like a small UK designer, but I do think this is really lovely. I'm pretty sure Addison Rae was wearing this when this first came out and I just love this. I think this is a really nice alternative to a plain white top. It's super feminine, but it's not too kind of boring, if that makes sense. I feel like this is a bit more tame, whereas this is like slightly more fun, but because of what material it is, it's still quite like young and fun, you know? I'm excited to try this one. I really, really hope I like this. I think this is so cute. I can see myself wearing this so much throughout the summer, I think, with low waist jeans, this could look really cool with some kind of like chunkier trainers, but also with a cute skirt, like a midi low rise kind of thing would look really, really sweet as well. You could even do like a fun pair of shorts. Like I could pair my Zimmerman high waist shorts with this for like a completely different look. I think this is so versatile and I'm really, really excited about this one. Next up, I picked up this. This is the Daisy Silk Top. Now Reformation are known for their silk. They have great silk products. And this I just thought was stunning. I love the fact that the strap are like a tie that you tie into a bow. I think that's really feminine and gorgeous. It's giving Cinderella. I don't know why. I think it's the color, but I do think this is really lovely. And hopefully it fits nicely because I think this in the summer is such a wearable piece with so many different things. You could dress this up in the evening, dress it down in the daytime, like on holiday. So I'm really excited for this one. I low key love it, but I don't know if I love it enough to keep it. I mean, the sleeves, of, well, the straps, I guess, are gorgeous. I just don't know if, I already know I shouldn't keep it, but what I'm saying is I really like it and it just fits like an absolute dream. I just don't know how it fits into my wardrobe. I had all these ideas of how I was going to wear it, but it kind of hits at that awkward point where you kind of have to tuck it into high-waisted things and then low-waisted things. Do you know what I mean? It's a bit like flouncy and cute to do the whole like low waist fun vibe. So I don't know if it's just a bit of a miss in terms of like where it cuts off. I don't know, let me know what you think in the comments. And finally on the top front, this does not look very pretty. <laughs> I hung it, I was like, how do I show you without it looking weird? But I actually ordered this so many months ago and just never got it. I guess it sold out, they canceled my order, but then I really wanted to try it. So it's a cashmere blend jumper. And I mean, the way they wear it on the website when they style it is just like one or two buttons done up and it looks really, really sweet. And I'm really into wearing this color. And I just think if this is right, it's gonna be really right, if you know what I mean by that. Like I'm really looking for something to wear with these leggings and I was hoping that they wouldn't be too dissimilar. I don't know, I'll have to try it on, but I'm very, very excited to see how this one looks on because it's so ridiculously soft. I can't make my mind up. I can't decide if I think I need a size up. I don't even remember what I went for. Probably a medium. Oh no, this is a small. So I'm like, do you know what I mean? Like, do I need it slightly larger? I mean, it's kind of sticking to me a little bit, which is making me feel a bit uncomfortable. But the sleeves are perfect. And I do think it's gorgeous. And of course, you know, it looks great with the leggings. But I feel like it's just a little fitted for me to wear it how I wanted to wear it. Like, I was thinking like big, baggy, oversized. And it's, I mean, it's big, but it's not oversized size. Do you know what I mean? I'm tempted to get the bigger size because I think it would be slightly looser. And that's like, I'm going for like this. 
<laughs> you know what I mean? Or is it just not gonna look like that? I don't know, let me know. As I said, I got a couple of skirts. Now they're actually identical, they're just different colors. So this one really caught my eye. It's like a sage green skirt. It's super long and I just really, like I need things that aren't jeans, that aren't leggings to wear day to day that are still going to look put together. That's what I'm on the hunt for and that I can transition from spring all the way through summer to the start of autumn. So this, for example, I was thinking I could wear it with just a nice cream knit and that's a really nice way for me to wear this when it's slightly cooler but in the summer with a tank or something like that super casual and then I can dress it up in the evening I really need like I'm craving those versatile pieces so this is called the Layla silk skirt so let's try it on I think this is going to be such a marmite piece but I love it this is exactly what I was going for obviously there won't be creases in it when I wear it but it's long enough and it fits my hips perfectly it's not too tight it doesn't cling it's not too big oh my goodness I would wear it with this tank this is so not like I, I feel like some people are gonna look at this and be like this is not even an outfit that's horrible but I just know what I wear and like how I live in my clothes and how I live in my clothes is dressing up things that like day to day that this should probably be a going out skirt but I will wear this day to day with like a really casual top and I will feel so put together I cannot even tell you how over the moon I am that this actually fits so happy and then identical to the green one i just got it in black i was actually well i ordered actually the top shop version from asos and it just felt horrible on it did not sit nicely the material just felt awful and i'd been eyeing these up for a while and i kept telling myself don't do it don't do it but here we are i was like we'll we'll try same thing love it this is literally what is missing in my wardrobe i mean they're gonna be a nightmare to wash aren't they but so is anything nice i've come to the conclusion and that's okay but yeah I love this I can wear this so many ways you can also wear it high-waisted which I mean maybe I would maybe I wouldn't but it's nice to know that I have the option and also like I've just eaten quite a big lunch if I like, went out to dinner and I was wearing it low-waist and I had like you know a big dinner and I was like oh and I wanted to you know cover up the bloat a little bit I could it's nice to know we have options but yeah I think this is really really sweet and I am 100% keeping these next up I actually got a cupboard so it's this black crop top now some of these things are pretty creased I literally received this delivery like 15 minutes ago I was so excited to get into it that I was like I'm gonna have to film the video right now because I hate doing hauls and like opening everything before and having a look and checking it out like I want my initial reactions to be with you otherwise it's a bit boring isn't it otherwise it's like a show and tell I want to discover it too so this looks really sweet the crease is a bit annoying but it is what it is and then so yeah it's a cupboard it comes with the skirt and this looks really fun now my only thing is I really want to know that I'm going to wear both of these pieces individually too and hopefully they fit but I think this is really cool it's a little different and I love that so let's try this and see how it looks another thing that I love obviously envision it without the big crease across the chest but I love the skirt it sits so nicely it's not too short it's not too long I love the detailing I think it's gorgeous the sleeves on the top are lovely it cuts off at such a nice point that I could actually wear this with low waist things as well I could probably wear this with the other skirt I just showed you and it would look really good I need to make some serious decisions because I can't keep it all however I do think this is particularly lovely and I don't know where I'd find anything else like this you know I feel like this could be a staple I had to try it to see how it looked and honestly I don't hate it it's very different for me but I mean they're obviously slightly different but when it's dark I'm not gonna tell by the way if you like these type of videos it would be amazing if you give this a like and as always just whilst we're into it everything will be linked down below in the description for you along with my reformation favorites because the jeans that I wear every day are reformation and a ton of like my everyday clothes are reformation next up I got the Rosalie dress in this print now again this is one that I'm just not as keen on I don't know what like something drew this to me on the website and now in person I'm just a bit it's a bit meh it's a bit sagey it's a bit average it's a bit do you know what I mean but I'll try it for you but I can tell you right now that I don't think I'll be keeping this you know you just know how annoying that I don't like the print because this dress fits like a glove and I love the neckline I'm so tempted to order this in black because this just fits like how I wish every dress would fit this is how I how a dress fits that I go get like tailored to fit oh I am honestly so disappointed that I opted for the pattern and not a plain black one because I was umming and ahhing and I was like no be fun 
Actually, if they do this in like a creamy colour, I would probably get that. I wonder if they do. They probably do. I'm definitely going to have a look though because this is stunning. Okay, you're probably going to laugh at me for this because I am so one of those people that is find something you like and buy it in every colour. That is me and it's terrible, but it's me. I managed to get the Zenny dress, I believe it's called. Yes, in white. So this I have in black. I love it. I wear it all the time. I have never had so many questions on a dress and I've never been told so often that I'm wearing a dress back to front because it's a super high neck but this is just such a gorgeous dress so flattering so like the neckline so modest but it's got a low v back it is sorry it's unzipped but you can see it's got a super low v back so i know i'm gonna keep this i know it fits but i will show you on anyway and yeah i have this in black too i'll link the black one down below it is one of my most worn evening dresses i'm low-key annoyed that it's so creased because it doesn't do the dress justice but look at the back it is just the most beautiful dress honestly this is one of those dresses that i would look for for so many years and if i didn't get this i would regret it and i just know how much i value beautiful dresses like this like this is a beautiful piece and i think this will be in my wardrobe forever and i love it and i'm 100 percent keeping this to match with my black one this is exciting so i initially saw this dress in like a champagne color but just could not get it in my size and then they brought it out in black now this isn't my size either this is a size up so i'm gonna try and see i was like i don't think it's gonna make that much difference because it's not like it's a skin tight dress but we'll see it's an off the shoulder long sleeve floaty mini dress i think this is so beautiful i really really love reformation's evening pieces they're really lovely their dresses and yeah this just really stuck out to me and i thought it was really different like you're not gonna walk into a high street store and see something like this i love like even the shape of the sleeves i think is really really lovely this is why i love reformation their pieces just like that little step up and i adore that and the material again is fabulous guys this is beautiful but it is simply too big you know when you do that thing where you have to like breathe into your chest and keep the air in your chest to keep something up or it's just going to fall that's how this feels however it is a beautiful dress i love the sleeves i think it's really lovely uh but yeah i just need to try and get hold of the size down and i also i i mean i probably i want to try the champagne one as well because this is again a beautiful dress sadly just couldn't get it in my size and i also love sleeves that like cover your hands a little bit i don't know why i just really like that this looks so bad <laughs> on the hanger i promise you on the model this looks divine it's got a cross at the back can you look there you can see a bit better and i want well, my back is one of my favorite parts of my body and i love anything that shows off my back and i'm like i have a few kind of christening wedding vibe things coming up throughout the year and i'm starting to try and collect pieces for it because you know how it is when you need to find a dress for an occasion you can't find any there's no nice ones or there's nothing in your size and it ends up being a last minute rush so whenever i see them i am picking them up at the moment to try on and then if they're perfect i will keep them it just gives me time to create a more kind of thought out collection of dresses as opposed to having a load of last minute dresses that i will only wear once so i'm excited to try this on again this is higher neck which is my preference i like that and hopefully this looks good this comes in so many colors as well but i can't be that guy i can't get in other colors <laughs> it's creased beyond belief which is so frustrating because i don't want to steam something if i'm not going to keep it because i don't want to damage anything and obviously i don't know before i try it on if i'm going to keep it or not so i adore this I think this is wonderful. It fits like a glove. The neckline I'm, is the only thing I'm a bit like, okay, I don't know how that sits. However, look at the back. I just love it. I just think it, it sits so nicely. I love the shape it creates. I love the back. I love how it crosses over. I love how it sits at the front. Like here, it's just the neckline that I need to kind of figure out, but this is so nice. Like I really feel amazing in this and I think that says a lot. This is another that I'm feeling a bit meh about. This is the Mika dress, I believe. Uh, yes, and it just looks a bit meh. It looks so lovely on the model and she looks so classy and so stunning. I just don't think it's going to give the same vibe on me. This is like a low bun kind of dress. Do you know what I mean? Low bun, cute sandals, gold jewelry, red lip. I mean. I love the shape 
I think it's lovely. I just don't think it's going to sit right on me. I mean, I could be wrong. I hope I'm wrong. You know what? I take it back. I think it's way nicer on than I thought it was going to be. Although, if I do decide to keep it, I think I will have it taken in slightly. It's the slight hang I don't like. Like, I want it like this. But it's a gorgeous shape. The straps are lovely. The material feels so lovely on. And yeah, I think it looks way nicer on than I thought it was going to. So I was completely wrong. I feel actually really lovely in this dress. I've just stood and looked in the mirror at myself for a good like three minutes like I think I really like it so what do you think do you like this I think this is one of those dresses that I would probably end up wearing way more than I thought I would my only kind of hesitation is that it's quite a thick material and it's obviously a summer dress so those two don't really go together but if it was like an evening -y thing maybe that's a benefit I don't know let me know what you think and finally, oh, back to front, I got this one. Again, another black evening dress. This one, it just sits kind of like this and then hangs straight. It doesn't go tight anywhere, which I really like. I have a, not similar dress, but a, a same neckline from Beck and Bridge and it just doesn't fit me properly. So I need to pass that one on and this is what I was thinking to replace that. Also, this kind of thing you can re-wear continually and those are the pieces that I love. I love being able to wear things over and over and over and over and over. So let's try it. I love it. I, I, this is so dangerous. I love it. I need to make some serious decisions. It's actually lined, so it's heavier. And doesn't stick to you this just sits so nicely it's elasticated along here and it doesn't make my boobs look weird you know sometimes these dresses can it kind of sits it's one of those dresses it's obviously not like tight so it leaves a bit to like the imagination you don't really know what like my body looks like in it which i kind of like because it means it's an eating dress this is like an evening dress if you're doing a dinner and you know it's going to be great food because you know there's room to, <laughs> there's room to grow which we love and you know i think sometimes we have to think about that especially if, like in a tight evening dress that's no fun. This is one of those dresses that looks really good, but just feels like you're wearing something super comfortable. So yeah, can you see? It's elasticated, but not in like a weird way. And it sits really nicely. I guess you could sit it a bit lower if you really wanted to. The back, it's just super plain, which I love. And I just think it creates a really nice silhouette considering it's it just kind of hangs. I am so surprised how much I like this. I think this is like a dead cert. So that is everything that I purchased from Reformation. I really hope you enjoyed this video. I love Reformation so much. So if you would like to see more, I tend to do Reformation hauls every other season. So subscribe and you won't miss my next one. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.